The day is finally here. Good morning, everyone. I'm Gabriel Pasquale. I'm co-director with Chris Keshian this year. Welcome. <laughs> Woo! Welcome to the ninth annual MIT Bitcoin Expo. I'm an embedded system security engineer by training, uh, and I'm currently a first year in the Leaders for Global Operations program studying uh, to complete an MBA and a master's in computer science. A few logistical items before we get started. So this is the Satoshi room. Um, you can see on the agendas outside that that's, that's labeled. And then if you want to get to the Nakamoto room, you can follow the hallway this way outside to building 26. The volunteers have green shirts, so feel free to ask them any questions. And the committee members have these Heather, Heather Gray shirts. Great. So the last time we were all on campus was March 7th, 2020 for the expo. And I can't believe that was more than two years ago. Uh, I was speaking to many of you at registration, and I can confidently say that everyone is excited to be back in person. This year, we have over 100 speakers. We have over 400 people registered for the hackathon. We have over 800 attendees. And if last year is any indication, we should have around 2,000 people on the live stream. I suspect most, if not all of you, have tremendous demands on your time, your energy, and your emotions. As we begin this conference, the United States and the world at large is experiencing conflicts, disruptions, and existential challenges unparalleled in my lifetime. These events can be understood as signs of destructive crisis or as signs of a creative transformation that will over time create a dramatically better world. I choose to see current events as the latter. And our conference today is about a set of, set of related technologies that will play a pivotal role in whether my optimistic view comes to pass. Technology, by definition, is free of value, philosophy, or moral aim. So it is up to us at this conference not just to consider how we can develop these technologies, but how we can simultaneously direct, manage, and regulate these cre creations to fulfill human ends and real human needs. In an industry now defined by hype, this is all the more important. We need pragmatic leaders who communicate the true possibilities and the real limitations of these technologies. It is only with a sober perspective on our path to financial and digital sovereignty that we will gain the trust of the people who will benefit most. The committee has centered ourselves on these guiding principles, and we are proud and incredibly grateful to bring together a group of speakers who exemplify these principles. Thank you to our speakers who are spending their weekend sharing their knowledge with our community and the world. The Expo has and will continue to be an agenda-setting conference. Conflict of interest between our sponsorship and content teams is taken very seriously so that we evaluate topics based on their merit and not the money that comes with them. We appreciate that our sponsors support this ideal and support the Expo. I'd like to begin by thanking our platinum sponsors, AcreWorld, Axelar, Binance, Blockdaemon, Foundry, and Coinbase. Without your support, the attendees would be reliving their undergrad days as the committee members served instant ramen and PB&Js for lunch. Next, I'd like to thank our gold sponsors, GitPoap, Figment, Hero, Immunify, Moonbeam, and Saya, as well as our silver sponsors, Blue Mind, Algorand, Flipside Crypto, The Tie, TrueFi, Stellar Development Foundation, and Metrica. Please visit the sponsor booths outside of the Satoshi Room to learn more about these great companies. My final thank you for now is to the Expo Planning Committee and the MIT administration for all of your hard work and your support of this event. From Lyanne in the Campus Activities Complex to Katie in the Registrar to Ramon and Ethan in the Seoul office, we could not have pulled off an event like this without your patience and support. Our all-star committee has worked countless nights the last six months to prepare a rock star lineup of speakers and panelists, and I am incredibly proud of the work that we have accomplished together. Without further ado, I'd like to hand it off to my Expo co-director, Chris, who will introduce and interview our first speaker, Michael Saylor. Thank you. <laughs> 